along those notes of things you can no longer use certain tools to gather, picks have become basically used for stone, metal, and coal only and bark. With Age of War Chapter 4, there have been a bunch of changes added to the game. Bloodier purges, periodically being attacked by these guys at night, as well as a whole array of weapon and thrall changes and nerves, and added a few additions like the pillar over there that we'll visit, which is how you turn off them guys, a few inventory changes, and a couple of th wild thrall behavior changes, all of which we'll be going through briefly today. Except for the purge and the hunt in detail, they will be separate videos. So first off, the hunt. It's quite fun. You can get these cool decorations, except for that, that's just an altar. You can get yourself a fancy new regalia and some claws and some mauls, as well as your very own were hyena hunter of Jebel Sag to follow you around and have at your base. He gets some pretty decent stats. I just admin leveled him so you could probably get him better if you're slowly leveling. But if you do not wish to partake or if you wish to actually fight the champions and earn some more goodies, head on over to this beam at D8. Talk to this guy, get your stories on how to find them all, see my separate little video, leave the hunt if you no longer wish to partake, and then spend your rewards over here. We have some bigger changes to our inventory UI, as you can see the way we search has changed a little bit. This menu is kind of what this one also should kind of be, they've just almost swapped them from what they used to be. Anywho, when you've got what you can make in here, it will actually have the number that you can make of it. So it will tell me I can make 333 fiber up here as well as down here. So it's just really reiterating that for you. This will leave it on whatever you last had it unless you press it again and that will set it back to normal. I usually have heaviest first, but now that's kind of hard. No sorting doesn't change it to like crazy stuff. You can move stuff around here and then I'm going to go heaviest first and then go no sorting and it doesn't keep it how it used to be. That I dislike because for filming videos, I used to be able to do that and then quickly go heaviest type, drop my stuff and go back to no sorting and or custom and that would fix what ailed me. But now that's not an option I get. They just randomly took that away. Let me know in the comments if there's something that you used or not at all, whether it bothers you. Not only RUI has changed, but also the thralls. You no longer have to hold down and struggle to find a thrall behavior amongst all of this. Also the uh, wheel has changed, so it's a bit more like a controller. Click on them and you can go chase and defensive, aggressive, aggressive, follow distance, all of that good stuff. It is a little bit harder to equip stuff. You can no longer press the right button. You have to press F and or double click or drag it on to them. Same with yourself. It becomes a lot harder unless you're just double clicking on everything. That brings us back to our UI. If you press right click, it's just going to split items now rather than consume. You actually have to press on it and press F. Dropping stuff is also a bit wild, especially if you have it in heaviest. And you can end up dropping stuff that you don't wish to drop by accident. So be careful when mass dropping things. It is almost better to drag it over here now, although a bit slower. This one's going to hit hard if you're like me and you like gathering crystals for making lots of boom maybe making potions and you don't buy your pots from Sepimero. Regardless, you're going to want to start doing that now because crystal just became a thousand percent harder. You can no longer use a pick to harvest. You cannot use a sickle because obviously we are a hand harvestable and a mass cull only. If you do not have mass cull unlocked through sorcery, I got a separate guide on all of that and how to farm your crystals with them. Check that out because that's definitely going to become goaded now. I know. Unless that's your Zyger. He, one of my old tribe mates, he used to hand gather crystal tens of thousands a day before he knew that you could use a pick. So he'd come in pretty clutch right about now. Along those notes of things you can no longer use certain tools to gather, picks have become basically used for stone, metal, and coal only and bark because flowers I can no longer pick. After years of them having that in the game, they've finally taken it out and I will have to make a whole bunch of different guide videos now about all of that. Yay! 
Yay! And uh, mushrooms can no longer pick them. But you can, in fact, sickle both. So all is not lost. You all just need a sickle now. And of course, you can handpick. Fun things that they have not fixed is when you're in single player and you reset your level for making guides, you just randomly lose an attribute point. That's fun. I'm so glad they added all this extra stuff in here, but they have not probably more than most likely, I can safely say, have not fixed hackers on official servers and haven't fixed this. But we do have fun new activities that are only staying peri for short periods of time. At least says that. Anyway, was going to see if there are still decent XP. They are kind of nerfed a little bit. Still kind of decent considering I'm level 30 currently. All these flowers are still pretty good. And ones like these are still pretty decent too. Check out the Black Garden quickly. Still got that good, good XP. Noxious Gas seems to still be the same. I have not tested heat stroke and freezing yet because they periodically do like to change that and make it deathy. And unlike our friendly folk over at Sepimeru who haven't not spawned in yet and unlike our friendly folk over in Sepimeru who do not attack us the same cannot be said about the folks up in the volcano. They're substantially more aggressive now which makes venturing around here a lot more dangerous as they tend to um have some pretty crazy weapons on them, Serpentman or Obsidian. Although even though when you kill them, they will generally only drop Serpent Man stuff. Yeah. Another bigger change is the ability to actually look at where you're attacking now. That has become a little bit better. Some of the rolling away from attacks and once you get hit have been not improved and it's not wildly smooth to say the least. Like I mentioned, there has been a couple of nerfs and tweaks to weapons and thralls here and there and the new addition of the raid ballista which I will go into in other videos. Now you've effortlessly harvested all of your supplies and you need to store them away. You can now go Q and it will add stuff that is already in the inventory. And you may have noticed earlier when I searched for stuff, it just highlighted it. And that could seem alarming to you if you usually go give all. But um, it now could it be over here. If I am to take all of the mushrooms and search mushrooms here, I can quick stack and then go give all. And it will only give the highlighted items. So even though it's annoying to scroll through them all because it doesn't get rid of it all. If you are transferring to a box and not using quick stack, it will only transfer and then take all of those searched items. The box sorting will be mildly more efficient once I've set up initially. For sure, it's definitely one of my more preferred changes. I don't love the UI changes, but hopefully they fine tune that a bit, although they possibly should have already done that before releasing it. So they'll likely leave it like this for another five years. Let me know in the comments what you enjoy about the update and what you don't enjoy. I'm always curious to hear what you'll have to say. If you're not already, consider subscribing, smash the like button if you found this informative. Stick around for another video on the hunt as we explore how to do that and how to get those awesome decorations that you've seen. Until next time, I hope you have an excellent day, evening, night, morning, whatever it may be, whatever you may be, have a good one.